uh, it's a bright new day once again and you're welcome back to my youtube channel and today that's why you can see that it's i'm very so excited have i told you that uh, i have to show you the clear examples on how you can do the things how you have to start small as uh, me being the one of the examples uh, i decided to start small as i'm starting the local typical local farming i just started with two birds and now guys as you can see they are already hatching if you can check in they are already hatching guys uh, guys you can see they are already hatching and this is really a bright and this is uh, our uh, day one uh, chick as you can check it, it also it is still also having the uh, uh, the two small and this the, the uh, you can see even the the worms hasn't started growing up guys as and i have promised you that to i'm going to give you the and, uh, farm update i am going uh, we are already here at our pen and they have already hatched out some because i did not press the eggs at the same day so we expect this one to hatch the next the day next but it had some day, some eggs that we are pressed earlier than others so i hope that also they have hatched so and now i'm going to correct the chicks and i put them here as i take them to the brooder guys and we shall see how everything is being done if you're new to my youtube channel don't forget to subscribe to my to, to the channel so that you get the farm all the things and the farm updates so uh as you can see already ah guys this uh this chicken is already aggressive so we shall see how we can do about it <laughs> Guys, as you can see, uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, this has already hatched nine eggs, and we can see already another one is hatching out. It is being, uh, it is getting out of the, of an egg. So we also remove slowly these uh, empties that they have hatched out. We also we have to also remove them so that also the remaining eggs can get the room. To hatch out we have to remove this uh, we have to remove these ones out these ones out and then you can see one two three four uh, there are also almost nine uh, remaining so guys and we shall allow them to uh, to continue so that also others can hatch out so I am also going to remove this one so that also the hatched ones I'm going to remove them and I take them to the brooder and I leave it for to hatch the the last one. Ah, guys, as this one had only three eggs that was pressed earlier than others, so we shall remove these three that has hatched and then we leave it to incubate others. Okay. So these are the chicks that have now hatched out and we have to also gently remove these empties out. So this one already has other more eggs to, to incubate because it, the eggs was pressed area. Okay, so we are going to leave them to incubate those eggs so that they finish incubating and we are going to take these ones to the incubator as guys you can see and uh, we are also we are just taking these ones to the incubator already they are around the 10 around 10 one two three four they, they are already 12 guys that has hatched out and we, they are already has some others which are still there so these ones we are taking them to the uh, to, to, to the brooder as we shall come back and collect more chicks from here as we take them to the brooder after when all the chicks as we, we have removed them out we shall also uh, press more uh, eggs this is the second day and we have already uh, introduced our local chicks here in our brooder 
uh, this is what we are using now to, for heating and these are the feeding fans as you can see I used uh, these are the we said we use the feed the feeder it so that they can act as the feeding fan these are our starter match guys which we are starting to feed our chicks and you can already see the result on the second day I will try to capture one one barrel too as you can see uh, this is the result guys so as uh, which we have already got and uh, we are going to continue giving you the updates on how we are doing it and we just uh, fabricated this brooder out of the cardboard which we used as a box in and we are using the charcoal to heat we have here our water and the feeding fans and you can see uh, guys if you check on this chick you cannot realize that it is a local chick it looks pretty like the exotic bird but no this is the local chick uh, this is all about how we have been able to feed it and it has come out clearly as you can see so more are coming so just what you have to do is to subscribe to our youtube channel smash the notification bell so that you get all the amazing videos which we are going to be posting from here the farm we have here and the, the chicks we are brooding here they are around 30 and we expect all of them to get over the brooder cause we doesn't expect the mortality here because everything is done well thank you so much catch you soon with another episode